Good morning. It is Wonderful Wednesday, the Daily Echo. It is June 11th. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I uh, wanted to talk a little bit about something that's uh, really, really important if you want to control your own life and if you want to get to where you want to get and you don't want to rely on other people's schedules. If you probably notice, a lot of your day revolves around what other people want you to do and not so much what you want to do. That is pretty much your own fault. I know it is my own fault. We think, no, I got to do this. I got to do this. The phone rings. Somebody else has me do this. But it's because you're not intentionally creating your day. You're not deciding what you want to do. Uh, the olden days when we used to go to the Franklin seminars, Franklin Covey seminars, I guess back then they were just called the Franklin Quest before Stephen Covey joined them. They used to teach about task management. And, and there's elaborate uh, day timers now to where you can do this. When I was with Ed Foreman last August, um, he introduced us to these sheets of paper. I don't know if you can see them. The six most important things I will do today, and you can see number one through six, and then you've got then I will, and you've got seven, eight, nine, and ten. This whole idea came came to pass when Charles Schwab, the president of U.S. Steel over 100 years ago, was uh, you know a great leader, a great uh, a great leader of people. Uh, it's incredible what he did. But a guy by the name of Ivy Lee came to Charles Schwab and said, I can increase your production. And Charles Schwab said, how much is it going to cost me? And he said, you pay me what you think it's worth. Try it for 90 days. So as all like, uh, Ivy um, Lee did is he, um, he introduced this to him. He said, okay, at the end of every day, sit down and think of the six most important things that you need to do and prioritize them. What's most important? Put it at one, and then number two, then three, then four, then five, and so forth. Do not go to number two until number one is done. At the end of 90 days, Charles Schwab sent Ivy Lee a check for $25,000. That's a tremendous amount of money 100 years ago. So you can see what the value was to U.S. Steel and Charles Schwab and his executive team. So if you want to continue to allow other people to dictate your day, don't do it. Just you know, show up every day. Don't decide what you want to get done. If you want to start being incredibly productive and start to achieve the dreams and the goals that you have, Every night, it takes five minutes, 10 minutes maybe. Sit down, think about what's the most important things to do. Number them one through six and prioritize them. Occasionally, uh, emergencies come up, but most of the time, follow that list to the T. Do one before two and so forth. You will be absolutely amazed within a period of 90 days how much you've gotten done and how much more you've uh, achieved in your life. You don't have to use this system. There's great, uh, there's great things for the iPhone that cross over to whether you use a Mac or um, a Windows. But give this a shot. You will be happy that you did. We'll be talking to you again tomorrow on Tremendous Thursday. Have a great day. See ya.